Okay, so here we're going to be looking, it says to find the original price given the sale price and the percent discount. So our problem is today only a desk is being sold at a 36% discount. The sale price is $496. Well, if it's only on sale for today, then what was the price yesterday? So we all know, right, that um, the sale price the sale price, let's see, sale price equals the original price minus the discount. Right, so the question is, well, what's the discount? Well, we know that the discount was 36%. But that's 36% off of the original price, right? So we can think of it as saying the sale price equals the original price minus, and instead of the discount, it's going to be 36% or 0.36 of the original price. All right, so this part here again is our discount. Well, we don't know what the original price was, so I'm going to call that x. And we have x minus 0.36 times the original price, x. Right, So everywhere I see an original price, I'm going to put an x there. And we knew that our sale price was what? Sale price was $496. So again, we have an algebraic um, equation, and we can just solve them, do the math, and we can find out what x is or what our original price was. Okay, so I don't have a coefficient in front of this x. That's just going to be 1. So 1 minus 0 1 x minus 0.36x is, is 0.64x, and that equals 496. So I solve this just like I would. I divide both sides by 0.64. So let's go ahead and do the long division. I have 0 0.64 goes into 496. I have moved the decimal place two places. So here's my decimal move two places. This is my new decimal. So let's see what we have. 64 goes into 49. Can't go into 49. Goes into 496. Uh, let's try 7. Since 7 times 6 is 42. That's getting kind of close. So 7 times 4 is 28. 42, 43, 44. So that's pretty good. Do the subtraction. 9 becomes 8. 480, and down another zero. So 64 goes into 448, it's like seven times also. Again, we already did the math from above. So 480, borrow one, you get two, that becomes a seven, you get 320. And let's see, 64 goes into 320. Five times zero three two. So it goes in evenly. So x equals seven seventy five. So the original price is seven hundred seventy five dollars.